you, Mr. Speaker. My question is to the Minister of Education. We all know that a nutritious breakfast is critical to the success of every child's development. Eating a healthy breakfast has lasting physical, mental health, and educational benefits. And this morning, the Minister of Education and the Minister of Children and Youth Services joined St. Joseph's College with the students for a nutritious start to their day. The minister also helped Breakfast Club of Canada, along with a corporate sponsor, Minute Maid, celebrate the 500th Ontario Breakfast Club opening this year. A healthy morning meal is now guaranteed to 90,000 students in Ontario schools, nearly 30,000 of them in the Toronto region. Now, Minister, can you let us, this House, know what the announcement today entailed and how we are ensuring that all children have access to a healthy and nutritious breakfast? Thank you, Minister of Education. Yes, and thank you to the member from Beaches East York for his interest in this uh, very important issue. Speaker, it's a top priority for this government to ensure that students are starting off their day with the support they need to succeed, and that includes breakfast. So the Breakfast Club of Canada was founded on the belief that every child has the right to succeed in life and, most of all, have the safe and reliable access to food. A healthy breakfast helps with stu be better student attendance, increased physical activity, increased self-esteem, and improved memory and cognition. Together with the Breakfast Club across Ontario, we have reached over 90,000 students, and this year, 500 schools. And you know, Speaker, 13,567,525 breakfasts have been served, and we were very helpful with our uh, uh, pleased with our partners, Breakfast Club, and Thank Minute Maid, to serve more this morning. Thank you. Thank you, Minister. And this is a very exciting milestone and an exciting announcement you made today. And I can tell you the success of the program is a priority for my constituents in the riding of Beaches East York. Absolutely. The club now has over 80 schools in the City of Toronto alone. And in my riding of Beaches East York, two schools take part in this excellent program. And we know, Minister, that the benefits of the breakfast clubs go far beyond the school walls. Evidence shows that schools with programs see improvements in attendance, punctuality, as well as in behaviour and concentration, and they help turn young people into better citizens. Minister, can you please tell us how our government is helping to support the Breakfast Club with their initiative to provide nutritious breakfasts to students across Ontario? Thank you, Minister. Minister of Children and Youth Services. Minister of Children and Youth Services. Thank you, Speaker. It was great to be at the Breakfast Club 500th uh, opening of uh, Breakfast Club of Canada. It was great. Minister Sandals was pouring the milk. I was pouring the juice and handing the fruit out. It's good to know we have other jobs if we need it. Um, but Speaker, it is a really great program, and thanks to our partners for making that happen. And our government, as you know, Speaker, announced an investment of $32 million over the next three years as part of our five-year plan to expand and enhance our student nutrition program. And in addition. 10.3 million will be invested in the program in this year and next. So the total funding is $31 million, Speaker. That's 340 new breakfast programs, and it is to establish uh, programs Answer. where there are higher needs. So it's very focused. 56,000 more children. It's fantastic. We're committed to making sure students in Ontario start their day off right. Thank you, Speaker. No question. The member from Lampton, 